There are seven fragments that are scattered across the server. When it's combined, it creates one of the most powerful items in the entirety of Minecraft. If we let it get into the wrong hands, it would end the entire server. So when a player named Muggum set out a mission to obtain it, we knew we had to stop him at all costs. Four months ago, me and my team tried jumping Muggum at his base, and even though it was a close fight, he escaped. Ever since then, this has sparked a three month long mission to end him once and for all. And it all starts today. This is because it's our last chance to make sure Muggum doesn't become the most powerful player on the server. Muggum has always been killing players, trying to get as much power as he can, and will stop at nothing. But this pales in contrast to what the seven fragments can do. We weren't told much about them, but the thing we were told about them was that they can make an item so powerful, not even the entire server against him would be able to stop it. So that's why if a player like Muggum got to it, it would be game over for everyone. So we needed to make a priority for him to not get that item. In order to do that, we need to start the hunt for the fragments. A book was given to a player named Silvasaur. I'll spare you the details, but the book had nothing that important in it, except for coordinates. This is the start of the hunt for the fragments. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, okay. The location of the coordinates is at a place called Friendship Island. Two players, Dabbycat and Silvasaur, made to have a peaceful time and chill out until e kind of murdered but them. But when we arrived at Friendship Island, nothing was there. Half of us stayed at Friendship Island while the other half went to another location we might think the clues are. But when the other half of players got to that location... Uh -oh. Like an oh, what the- oh, 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 What? Oh, what? Oh, no. All right, how did this area that was perfectly normal just a bit ago turn into a giant crater? Well, the way we get the fragments is by these meteors scattered across the server. Once they come down, inside them are the fragments. And the person who got the fragment for this one was Dabby Cat. Wait, what's this? A why? I just got a wire fragment. And it turns out Dabby Cat's on Muggum's team. It's fine because the person who collected the item can't hide it in Ender Chest or anything because they can't be dropped unless you kill them. We still have a chance at winning this. So we went to the next location, and when the asteroid landed, Muggum got Oh killed. my oh. gosh. Oh. Whoa. It's all the oh, wires gone. I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, nice, 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 nice. So far, his team is two. We need to get the next items if we were going to stand a chance against Muggum. So we went to the next location, and it was an old abandoned base made eight months ago. If we were to summon the next asteroid, we needed to. Oh, and after an actual hour and 30 minutes, we finally finished the base, and now we can get that item. And for the first time, we got the item, and nobody knows who got it. But it was Dominoka who got it and gave it to Murphy. We finally did it. We just need to keep up with the pace we're at. But the next location would change the direction of everything. The next location is in the end, but the only problem is that the end is closed because someone broke all the portals a couple months ago. How would this even be possible? For the past three months, I have been trying to figure out a way to get into the end, and after utilizing an awesome glitch, yeah, 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 but great, now that they have end portal frames, we can go to the end now, right? Hey, okay, listen, listen, listen. We we have the way to bring back the end, but it's gonna cost you something. Oh, no. Nah. All right, you guys, know, thank you for joining us. You know, Who oh, here has the artifact? Who has the artifact? I guess somebody fess up because we're not gonna progress. Because these guys are just gonna hold us hostage here, bro. We can't give over the item at all costs. But it isn't as simple as that because we can't even give over the item even if we wanted to because we don't even know who has it anymore. So our only option was to stall Muggum as long as possible. Do you think that they think we're fucking around? Yeah. But after enough stalling, Fuki will just have to watch everybody die in God, 10, nine, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, I'll I'll screen share, I'll screen share, I'll screen share. I don't want to kill it. Oh my god, god. It's, it's, over. it's over, it's over, it's over, it's over. Hey, whoa, 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 I don't have it, I don't have it, I don't have it, I don't have it, bro, I don't have it. Bro, I, don't, no don't have it. I can screech I can screech I don't have it, bro, chill. Oh, it ain't about that, it's about oh. sending a message. But people started to get killed by Muggum and his team. Although, I was actually smart because I dug away. But after 20 minutes, no one stepped forward to give the item. But where did it go? We can't just lose an item that valuable. Well, I checked Discord only to find out that we have the item they were looking for. With two items in our possession, we are catching up to Muggum, and all we need to do now is enter the end. Dude, your stuff is still there, bro. So we summoned the dragon and beat the game in world record time. Oh my goodness, that was fast! And when the asteroid landed, Rylan got the item, but Muggum started to kill Rylan because of that. 
Rylan got it. Rylan got it. Mugum has gone too far for these items. I wanted to help and save Rylan, but I knew if I interfered with Mugum, he would kill me. So me and E-Quarter went to the end islands to wait out Mugum going on his rampage. And while you're waiting, you could subscribe. Please. Now, did going to the end help? No. 10 minutes went by and the only thing that has changed is that the end is a war zone. We now. needed it to escape so we can all survive and keep the eye. Now there are several people guarding the portal and I would have to be sneaky about this. It was the netherite. Okay, the okay, 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 okay. If I could break through Mogum's obsidian barrier without his team noticing, I would be able to escape, effectively being able to regear my team and winning this once and for all. But I'm just saying, I'm just saying that's up to you. I'm the out. netherite is a problem. Guys, I'm out. I'm out. Now, I may be out of the end, but my friends aren't. So they're all stuck in the end with no gear. There's a vault a couple thousand blocks away, but E Corridor accidentally leaked the coordinates. So I need to get there ASAP. But as I was about to leave those items. A player named Ember wanted to talk, and something unexpected happened. Do you need anything from here? Holy crap! This is a lot. I got more. Um, open the e-chest again. Oh my goodness, Ember, you're stacked! I'm getting a call from my friends. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a couple of these, if that's fine with you, and I'm gonna get Go. near the portal. All right, thank you. I'll see you on the other side. Just in the nick of time, Pookie and E Corridor made it out of the end, and we all went to retrieve the items from their vault. But when I got there, E Corridor already got the stuff, so me and Pookie decided to go thousands of blocks away to make a new vault. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go right here. We also got a bunch of good loot. <gasps> what the f Because finding all these fragments is so predictable, we all made a plan to get the last fragment and stop Mugum's team. Because the last fragment is guaranteed to spawn, we will first go to the top of the netherrack pyramids above spawn. Then we'll wait for the other team to spawn in the asteroid. Then when the asteroid drops down, we will land down, snatch the fragment from everybody, and after that, the last step is to kill Mugum. Then all that is left is take the fragments and make the most powerful item in Minecraft and end the server in peace. So we got the last of the materials and then we left our base and went to spawn. This was our last chance at getting the fragment. We needed this to work. Dude, look. All right. Name Pookie and your he's completely alone. No, he's not. Who is that? Is that Quackatus? No, it's Dabby Cat. Okay, never mind. It's him and Dabby Cat. Nine, bro. That's like nine I can't put. I can't put my. No. Thing. <gasps> What'd you do? Did anything you happen? Oh no. Yeah, I fell. I fell. I fell. I don't think they saw me though, and I didn't push to Why did you? How did you fall? There were a couple close calls, but for the most part, we were fine. Everyone in the oh, corner oh, oh, no. Wait, what the heck? Oh, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? That's Dabby Cat. Oh, Dabby, I feel like Dabby definitely just saw me. He, I feel like he definitely just saw me. Are you down oh, here? That's someone behind me. Yeah, someone with the Elytra. Yeah, it's Silvasaur. It's Silvasaur. Oh, shoot. Oh, there's someone they found yeah. us? Yeah, yeah go. Uh, I, I, okay. I saw him. I saw him. If, oh, oh, they're there. Bro. If they see us, then we just go where in. Like, who they've seen us, yeah. They run, run, us. run, 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 run. They know where run. we are. Away? They're flying. I see Silvasaur. Yeah, oh! Silvasaur saw me. They're up here. They're up here. They're up here. Wait, should I fly? What do we do, though? I don't know what to do. Guys, no, no, don't scatter. Don't scatter. Do we just go to spawn? Do we just go go in? They're, they're chasing me, brother! Oh, I see them! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! What are they doing? No! Are they actually like the fight we need? Guys, turn them off. Mine it. Someone mine it. Someone mine it. Do I go in? I'm, I'm the only one. Go in, go in, go in. Oh shoot! I'm gonna chase my dad! Guys, I don't have Dude, this. Dude, this is. Because I just sleeped down again! Go to the. Go gather around the meteor location. Are we chill? Are we chill? Mugum's, Mugum's, we should join their call. We should join their call. We should join their call. We might not have to fight. We might not have to fight. Game breaks, Game breaks, group chat. So the plan is pretty much falling apart. Without our element of surprise, it's gonna be a lot harder to get the fragment, especially because we don't know how to activate the last asteroid. If we end this off peacefully, legit everything we've done was for nothing. Like. But no, I don't know. Like, the other way around. No, the way around. Bro, no, it was no, bro. Everything. These fragments. No, these fragments are like meaningless at that point. Exactly. That's Maybe the they were point. always meaningless. Maybe they were never actually Muggle. had a meaning. It was all an assessment system. I don't know about you guys, but I don't think I really hate a peaceful ending. See? Yeah. I like what happens with that. Like... Something I forgot to mention is that because the server is like eight months old already, we're gonna end it. That's why it's so urgent for Muggum to get those items as well. I know what to do. I know what to do. Look at me, everybody. It's Congo line time. Oh. No way. The last thing we resorted to was a Congo line. As dumb as it sounds, we all started the hunt with a Congo line. So maybe that's how we end it. Oh, 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 is that oh, actually oh, it, bro? Yep. No I way. It. Also, oh, oh, holy crap. Oh. 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 Oh.
my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's all gone! It's, it's all, gone. all gone! Although this seems like the end of the server with spawn completely destroyed, we still haven't killed Mogum or figured out what the gem fragments do. Until in the Discord, the prophet, the person behind all this, sent a message. We get to unlock the golden gem. This gem has the ability to take powers from the other gems and gets its own unique powers when doing so. But in order to craft it, you need obviously the gem fragments. So Mugum and Will were trying to get us to give over the fragments, but Will came to a realization. We, we thought that you would just be able to pass the golden gem freely between other people, but that's not the case. One person's gonna have it, and then that's just it. And I know damn well that if those wire fragments go to our team, they're going straight to Muggum. Now, Muggum's my teammate. Muggum's my slime. But I know for a fact that if I stood in the way of him getting that golden gem, that he would he would turn on me in a heartbeat. Guys. For a while now, honestly, I feel like I've been living in Muggum's shadow. Uh-oh. Uh, he joined my yeah, team. Was... He joined my team. He kind of took it from me. So you know what? I think that for the first time since I got those pants stolen from me, I think I want to stand my ground. Muggum... I challenge you to a 1v1. Oh! oh. It's okay, it's okay, okay. It's okay. Yeah, it's the end of the arc, the end of the arc. A fight to end Mugum once and for all. Obviously, it's just a fight for Mugum and Will, but we think that Mugum's teammates are going to restock him, which isn't allowed. So we started to keep an eye on Mugum's teammates to see if they were going to pull anything. I'm going to message Will, you got yeah, this. I'm, I'm Dude, this fight is long as fuck. No, Wait, it, it isn't Wait, even going over. Tyrus going over. Wait, where they, where they go? go? Where they go? I see Maga. Where? Is he running? No way. All right, kill him. Kill him. He's running. Where'd he go? Where, where'd he go? Looks like your honor disappeared along with your morals, buddy. Not only was Mugum's teammates restocking him with the gear, but for the first time in Bliss SMP history, Mugum ran from a fight. Mugum couldn't even take a 1v1 anymore. He wasn't as powerful as I thought. And for Mugum's teammates... Who they had three? the one? So you know what's gonna the, happen, the other You know what's gonna happen. Okay, so why are me and Daddy Chat getting the blame for this? I really don't because understand. Because you're the ones yeah. who can't make up you your mind! Me. No one's forcing last you last to be with him. No one is forcing you. You saw what he did, bro. That 1v1, that those are sacred, bro. You don't just run from that like that. That's ridiculous. The amount of teams he's been in that he's just thrown away because he wants more power. Like, yeah, exactly. Do you guys actually not think that he's gonna do something to you? Do you actually think he's your friend? We could be in the it's literally an infinite cycle. He always does the bad now. Tired Quackatus and Novigrid also left Mugum's team. It seems that Mugum can barely take a fight without his team, but now that they left Mugum, he might be done for. With that in mind, we found out how to end this once and for all. Mugum has exploits alongside Will, and they both realized that if they kept those, they would never be able to finish any fights ever because they're literally unkillable with the exploits. We decided to make a fight, one that Mugum can't back down from. He gets to fight with all his teammates, which is just like two people, against the entire server, and he agreed. So we headed over to the location negative 1k, negative 1k to have our final fight. All right, go. Oh, Wait, they're playing on, they're playing on, they're playing on, they're playing on. Oh, hold that mole, thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh, Who's putting me out? Is that Silva? Oh, so no, I need to change my kick line, bro. Where is Wait, where is, where is Muggum at? Guys, where is Muggum Where is Muggum at? Muggum is over there. Wait, he's over there, he's over there. I see him. Bro, you put on your chest plate, bro. Same guy. Oh boy. We got this. Wait, did Dabby and Silva already drop? No, Dabby, was, come on, let's, let's go! go. Let's let's go. go. Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah, we need to get like a coordinated dagger strike on him. Dash, man. Alright, oh, I got my dagger. It's kind of hard when he's constantly. Wait, where is it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh yeah, he might he might bomb. No, don't even try, don't even try, don't even try. Okay. No, I can do it, I can do it. <gasps> nice. I'm dead, bro. Oh, no, no way. way. No way. What? No way. Wait, no I way. We actually won. Mogum fell into the void, losing everything he owned, including the only set of netherite on the server. And more importantly, we got all the fragments. But as cool as the golden gem sounds, I don't really care about it. We've killed Mugum, something that we've been trying to do forever now. We've officially saved the server. So the entire server sat down to take one final screenshot. And then I looked over the crater 
and I jumped. As I fell into the crater, I remembered everything I had done. Stopping an infamous server griefer, dropping 1,000 villagers from world height, making Minecraft's biggest mystery, stopping Mugga once and for all, and just having a fun time. And when I saw the server close, eight months was gone. I wasn't sad, I just knew something else was coming. And that something is Bliss SMP Chapter 3.